Hello and welcome to the Speaking English Podcast. My name is Sebastian, I'm your host, and this is episode 186. Melina from Italy asks to talk about to eat versus to have uh, when it comes to food. And um, basically... Um, You're eating potatoes would mean um, that you're literally eating potatoes. Or you could say, I ate potatoes for lunch, which would mean that you ate potatoes for lunch. Um, you could also say, I had potatoes for lunch. And this would imply that you ate them. Um, but I think it comes from um, a little bit from being in a restaurant. And then the waiter comes and you sit there with the menu. And he asks you what you want, and then you say, "Oh, I'm, I'm gonna have the potatoes, please." Okay, that means you are going to order. You ordering the potatoes, and um, once they have arrived at your plate, then you will eat them. And um, it's all have in this case. It's is kind of like a possessive form. They are yours. And uh, when you talk about what you had for lunch, um, it's really a uh, a possessive and uh, a past tense of uh, you know, like I had the flu, I had potatoes, I had uh, good looks once when I was younger. I had potatoes. Okay, it's just a past tense form uh, signifying that this once belonged to you. Or it was something that you interacted with, like the potatoes. They kind of belong to you, but you ate them and now they're gone. So you technically don't no longer have them. Well, this is all long winded, but I hope you, you, you get the, uh, the gist of it. Okay, so if you say, I had the potatoes, then you say, well, yeah, I had potatoes. Now they're gone, um, but it, of course it also implies that you ate them. Uh, I ate the potatoes, obviously, otherwise I would not have had them on my plate. I hope that helps. Let me know if it did, and let me also know if it didn't. Thanks for watching. Take care.